I'm Carter and this is Emmett and you're watching the Davenport Daily News. Here's your student spotlight. Our student spotlight this week is Liam Lee. Liam is a fantastic artist. Seriously, you're probably going to hear a lot about this kid in the future. Liam is a kindergarten here at DSA. His teachers are Ms. Kaiser and Ms. Condon. Here's an illustration for a story that Liam wrote about SeaWorld. Ms. Kaiser says that she's always amazed about how much detail Liam adds to his drawings. And guys, did you check out his handwriting? It's a work of art. Liam enjoys drawing and coloring when he is not at school. He would like to be an astronaut when he grows up. We salute you today, Liam. Emmett, what's for lunch? <laughs> Today's lunch is chicken patty sandwich, Italian sub, Southwest chicken salad, breezy, Sweet potato rice and fruit and veggies. Stay tuned for some announcements. I'm Anna. And I'm Julia. And we are here to invite you to a very special event at DSA. Student-led conferences. November 15th, 5 to 7 p.m. It's one of the most important dates of the year. Here's what to expect at your student-led conference. It's time for student-led conferences. You can bring your parents. Show off your achievements and goals. Let them meet your teacher. What do you Show them around the school. I like introducing my dad to all these new things that he never knew about me. So how do you think it's going? With the middle sounds. What you're working on right now. Can you show me your skills? And then I need to grow three more points, which will bring me by the end of the year to. We done everything here? I think. Okay. Right. Can you double check, please? Thank you. In my celebrations, I got Dean's Day for my lead rewards on September 10th. I also got Just On Day for October 15th. I got Straight A's. I met my Argo, which is Chick-fil-A. All A's, and then Patty Pass and Assignment Pass. And then I went up to the eighth Oh, very cool. 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 That is so awesome. My wake's widely important goal is bringing down a Mazetta. Uh huh. First grade. Wow. So, which one is this? Is this math or reading? Math. I was part of the transition team because I was a messenger. Okay. Yeah. First, English, first. Yeah. Can you read them now? Um, these are my graphs from every time I take a star test. That was the first one. Okay. I was part of Curtis Group. I was teacher in training. That's what I am right now. My celebrations and all my video cards. Most recent test. And this is the uh, school wide wigs. Wildly important goal. This was my first reading goal in October. Oh, okay. What are the red light, green light mean? Oh, so whenever I would do this one, I had to color it green, and whenever I would do this one, I would color it red. So this is the thing that I learned. Well, it was great. I love the, the way they explain everything. The system is awesome. Awesome. That's a great job. Very good. It was amazing. She's a, a great facilitator, so 
I learned a lot today. It's been so fun. I love being able to kind of walk in his shoes for the day. Come see why Student Loan Conferences are so special. Hey Emmett, let's go carve a pumpkin. It's pumpkin season. The first pumpkins didn't look like this beautiful orange pumpkin we have today. They were actually small and hard. This one I'm going to be carving today is big, fresh, and a beautiful orange. Come on, let's carve a pumpkin. Here's what you'll need. A pumpkin, a pumpkin carver or sharp knife, a tiny candle or light, and an expo marker. First, grab your newspaper or paper towels to lay your pumpkin on so you don't make a mess. You'll need a bowl for your pumpkin seeds. Next, draw a circle around the stem of the pumpkin. Draw your eyes, nose, and mouth. Cut along the line all the way around. Now, you can clean up the seeds and all of the guts of the pumpkin. Um, um, this is quite gross. Yeah. You can roast your seeds later. Carefully cut out your eyes, nose, and mouth. Once your pumpkin is clean, insert your lights. And now look, a beautiful pumpkin ready for the fall. Say bye, Emmett. <laughs> <laughs>